Hi everyone, I'm Kate McCauley. Welcome to part two of Sneak Peek Week. So for this video, we are talking about the Keep It Simple Babe t-shirt. It's a sleeved t-shirt with a semi-fitted body and it has a whole heap of sleeves and a whole heap of necklines and it is the perfect basic t-shirt. So let me go quickly through um, the necklines that we have and the sleeves and then I'll show you all the samples that I've made. So let's start with the highest neckline. We have a gorgeous turtleneck and you can have either a non-fold or a fold over option. We then have a crew neck. We have a high round neck and a low round neck. We have this gorgeous squared neckline and there's a high and a low in that one too. Um, and we have the V-neck. Oh, and a boat neck. Um, sleeve wise, we have this little teeny weeny short, like a cap sleeve. We then have a short sleeve. We have above elbow half sleeve. We have a below elbow half sleeve. We have a long sleeve and then we have a long sleeve with a cuff and you can either have the fitted cuff or the relaxed cuff. Uh, body fit wise, it's a semi fitted tee. So it's not super tight. Um, you can adjust it to suit your body. It's super easy just to take it in a tiny bit if you wanted to. Um, and then there are two cutting lengths, the short length and then a longer length. Um, short length is great if you just want it to sit like on your hips, just below your hips. Um, and then the longer length, if you've got a long body or you prefer that longer length. Okay, let's get started. So as I mentioned, this is the little short, um, like a cap sleeve. So it's lovely and little, easy to wear. Um, this is a cotton lycra, um, so it is perfect for a fitted t-shirt. And the neckline on this one is the squared neckline, um, and it's the low cut version. The new squared neckline is fast and easy to sew. Now, it's not a mitered corner um, squared neckline. It's got curved corners making it really, really fast and easy to sew. Now, the reason I didn't want to do a mitered corner um, squared neckline is because I wanted it to be easily achievable for everybody. So everybody can jump on their machines and sew one up and wear it and feel amazing. Your fabric choice will definitely make a difference with how the garment fits and the neckline that you choose. For instance, with this squared neckline, a cotton lycra is going to sit slightly higher than a more drapey, looser knit fabric like, say, a ray rayon spandex. This one is a new favourite. This fabric is so soft and beautiful. It's a rayon spandex um, from Wicked Fabrics and it's just, it's so lovely to wear. I actually have a Friday feel skirt planned to wear with this so I can wear it like a fake dress. Um, okay, so as I was saying before, um, the fabric that you use will make a difference in how the neckline sits. This is exactly the same neckline as I just showed you in the cotton lycra. Um, but because the fabric is drapier and a softer, looser kind of knit, um, less, less bounce back, so less resilience, it is, you can see, it's slightly more open. Um, I've used a different fabric around the neckline, um, something with slightly more resilience, um, just to keep that nice and firm. This is the below elbow three quarter sleeve. And this is, it's just gorgeous. And so, so simple and fast for you to make. Now this gorgeous little one, this is a really soft, it's like a single brush poly um, with the little cap sleeve. Um, and this is the higher squared neckline. So, I'm not flashing anything. Um, really, really, really cute. And I say cute a lot. <laughs> you can pair this one with um, cargos, with jeans, with shorts. You know, it's a basic tee. You can put it with anything you, you like. And with this gorgeous squared neckline, it's right on trend. Next up, we have the crew neck. I adore a good crew neck. This is um, banded in a contrast fabric. It's a rib, so it's really, really stretchy. And, um, and then the short sleeve. Really, really cute. I've paired it with the symphony skirt because I wanted to show you that you can do the whole dress thing that I showed you in the 
Hello Gorgeous video with this one. So tuck yourself in. Nice and even. Grab your belt. And flip it on. Make sure that's even. Look at that. All I need is a beret. And stripes look fantastic with animal print. This is the symphony skirt again. How about teaming it with the In My Stride skirt? And the same skirt with a belt. And if you're heading to the beach, this is one of our most popular patterns, the sachet shorts. Cute. Next up, we have the crew neck again. This is in a really soft sweater knit. Um, I've used a different fabric on the neckline. And then it's the long sleeve with the cuff. So nothing boring about that. Here it is paired with the In My Stride skirt. And it's got that sort of dressed up casualness that we love so much. And I get a butt. So it's really easy to just pair with whatever you have. Choose an awesome fabric, like let your imagination run wild. Because it's so simple and basic, you are gonna shine through. So you can use whatever fabric you want to express your personality. And that is what I love about it. We have two classic rounded necklines. This one here that I'm wearing is the high rounded neckline. Um, and I've got it with the little short sleeve. Um, this is gorgeously soft, uh, viscose elastane, really, really beautiful to wear, particularly in the summer in a warm climate. And the low neck in Boo Spandex. Next we have the V-neck. So if you've never done a V-neck before, now is the time to try. The way that I explain it in the tutorial, it's totally achievable. So if you've been dying to make one, now's your chance. So this is the short sleeve. Um, this is in cotton lycra and it's just lovely and cool and soft. This one I'm wearing is in um, an art gallery fabric. Really, really soft, really lovely to work with. And this one is the boat neck, the above elbow half sleeve in um, a fabulous, it's just poly jersey, but the print is so cool. No matter what you team it with, the, the color with one of the colors in here, it just pops. So this again is with the symphony. What a sea effect dress. This is the Friday Feels skirt. Um, and then the um, Keep It Simple tee on top. This is the boat neck. So it sits out nice and wide. This is the very, very shorter sleeve, the little cap sleeve. And it's just a poly jersey. Choose a statement fabric and then you will have a top that you can dress up or you can dress down with jeans or cargoes or go super, super casual in denim. A statement fabric is amazing. For those heading into winter soon, we have the turtleneck with the long sleeves. So this is just a poly jersey. Um, I've used the fold over neck band because my fabric is um, quite floppy. So I like the structure of having the fold over one. Um, and I've teamed it for a fake dress with the Friday Feels skirt. And I feel hot. And if you love a belted look, you can do that with this one too. Or go totally casual and wear it back with your cargoes or your jeans. This one has the relaxed long sleeve cuff. This is the single fold turtleneck. It's got the fitted cuff. And this fabric is, it's, it's weird. It's, it's really stretchy, but then once it gets on my body, it's like it hugs back into my body, but super casual, really, really warm, really easy. Just with denim. Oh, I have a bit more fun and match it back with a print. This is the In My Stride skirt in Boo Spandex. If you are like me and you get very, very cold, 
um, classic turtleneck jumper in merino wool. Just snugly warm and fast and easy to make, which we love. And a black turtleneck jumper, it goes with so many things. Weekend, out to dinner, out with friends, or teamed with the Urban Wine Deck pants for a work look. Just have fun with it. If you're a pattern hat girl, I've managed to do one. So this is the neckline of the new pattern, the Keep It Simple. Um, and this is the XL. So you can quickly and easily mash the patterns and the necklines. I would love to hear which sleeve, which neckline, which fabric is your favourite. I hope you loved it. So watch out for the tester photos and I will see you in the group.